Hey folks, it is Wednesday, 27th of November, it's about five o'clock. Um, home from work, I have just one child with me uh, for now. Uh, Jack has gone to a friend's for tea, or food, dinner, I don't know, whatever people call it, tea. Um, so, Tevin came home on his own. I messaged Jack's teacher and said, please release the child to Luca's mum. When she came back, I said, yeah, that's fine. Thank you for letting me know. Because um, he has to be released to a parent. Um, Tobin didn't in year three, but Jack's class do now in year three. Mm. Excuse me. So, yes, did that. Tobin came home on his own. He actually came home quicker than I expected. I got home from work and thought, I'm going to make the most of it. I'm going to do some exercise. But I plan to go to the gym tonight. Um, but I've got to go and fetch Jack, so it's like right in the middle of when I would ideally want to go to the gym. Yes? Hi. Hi. Tevin has cool hair, but when he Does bothers it. to gel it, <laughs> or when I pin him down and do you it. You don't pin me down. No, I don't mean physically pin you down. No, you don't even like, go on, Tobin, do it. It's like No, I have to do it for you. Yeah, but it's um, like, you don't... What like, do you want? Do you know my glasses? Uh, I'm good at... No, have you checked my check bedroom? It. You took them off me this morning when I accidentally wore my home once and then on the way to school. You took the shoe cupboard? Yeah. Oh, you guys, have to. Uh, I cut my thumb. Yeah. It's yeah, like my thumb's been hurting and then you finally got around to actually looking at it and went, oh yeah, that's why. Doop. Yeah. Go and look for your glasses, I don't know. Okay. Check the shoe cupboard though. I can't remember where. Uh, maybe in the kitchen when I did your hair. Go oh. check. Um. Bye. Where was I? <laughs> See you, mate. Um. Can't honestly remember what I was saying. What was I saying? Exercise. So I did um, 30 day shred level three. Oh my gosh, that's hard. Mm. Gillian Michaels, who did, I believe, The Biggest Loser in the States. She's good. She's, oh my word, it was hard. Um, obviously you're supposed to build up to it, but I've done, I've gone through like the 30 day shred before, but uh, the only one I could find was level three. Are you serious? Not They're not in here. Check the kitchen, check the shoe, check cupboard. The kitchen and shoe cupboard. Check my bedroom, your bedroom. Did I do your hair in the bathroom? Maybe. Check the bathroom then. Um, so I can talk to you in the video, guys. Okay. Bye. Um. It's gone again. What on earth? Yes, I had to find it on YouTube because Paul very helpfully um, used the pen drive I had the file on and put a, some, some of Tobin's homework on it. Mm, my exercise videos have gone. So I found it, all I could find was level three and I thought I'm just going to do it. I've got some on DVD, but it meant using the PlayStation 4, which meant ejecting Paul's game, which I've done before and he's been in the middle of something and leaves it suspended. And I got in trouble, so I don't touch it anymore. <laughs> anyway, all this to say, I've not done a lot of crochet. Uh, let me show you. So yes, I have exercised. Uh, 27 minutes of, of um, strength, cardio and ab training. Ouch. I feel that tomorrow. And then I have to like, crouch down. I've been to the library with Toby because he ran out of books uh, a week early. So um, he's had to go and get some more books. I've got Jack some new books. That's where we've been until now. Um, so here are our Grump's feet. This is going to be Grump by uh, the left-handed crocheter. So there's his body, finished it off. There's his feetsies. So cute. They, I don't think they go on like that. And I made a start on his little hand this morning. How cute is that? So I'm going to continue to work on this tonight. I'm not putting the kids to bed. Uh, and I've got some time now, I'm not going to the gym. Um, but she knows. We've got a barbecue picnic kind of thing at work tomorrow, even though the weather's bad. Um, but it's somebody's 50th birthday, so we've all put in to have some food. Um, I don't even know, what's, what's happening Friday? Nothing, I don't think. And then I've got the craft fair. So, oh yeah, Toby, uh, Jack's got a party on Friday. So I've got to go and fetch him Friday night, I 
think I've got to go fetch him. The mum of the kid whose party is is taking him because I couldn't get get him there on time. Um, so yeah, she's taking him, and I think I'm going to go fetch him. Unless she wants to bring him back, that would be awesome. But I don't want to assume I can get there for picking up time. It's fine. Um, so yeah, that's it really. Not a lot has happened today. I haven't watched any videos or anything because I haven't really sat down. Uh, or I've, I'm sitting down now, but I got home, exercised, had a shower. Tobin rang the door as I was putting conditioner on my hair. I thought, I've got time to get in and out of the shower before he gets back. Um, yeah, quickly had a shower while he got changed and then we went off to the library. Um, yeah, it's been nice. Get the stuff done and out of the way. I was going to go pick up hair dye, but by the time we came out of the library, it was tipping it down and I thought I'm just going to get in the car and go home. So I did. So I'm going to drink my cup of tea, wait for Paul to come home. Then I'm going to cook. We're going to have salmon and rice for tea. Um... I think Jack's supposed to be having sausage and, I don't know, sausage, chips and vegetables. That would be interesting if he eats vegetables for somebody else, but as long as he eats and is well behaved, that would be nice. Um, yeah, I think that's it. So I've, I've not got a lot to tell you, I'm afraid. Um, I hope you're all okay. Um, we're, we're more than halfway through the week now. Well, we definitely will be, will be by the time you see this. So I hope the week is going well for you. Anyone who's got affairs coming up at the weekend, um, good luck. I hope it all goes well. I know Lucy's got one. Hi, Lucy. Um, on Saturday, same as me. Uh, so I'll keep you posted. Saturday's the last day of November. Can you believe it? Uh, December on Sunday. Paul's birthday as well. Um, yeah, December. Where's the year gone? Oh, it's unbelievable. Um, yes so i will my last day of filming will be the craft fair and that will be uploaded on sunday and then yeah i don't know what i'll do i think my lollies order is due tomorrow did i tell you what they did how lovely are they they had a 20 percent off coupon over the weekend which is when i placed my order completely forgot about it just went on lollies and ordered and it was like Lollies has sent you a refund through PayPal. I was like, have they? Why? They've not got something. No, they'd applied the 20% discount for me. How? I sent them a message uh, like through their Facebook page saying, thank you for doing that. I'd completely forgotten. I didn't mind. Well, I wasn't going there because of the 20% off particularly. I think I must have just seen it, you know, seen them in my timeline. I thought, oh, I'll go and check Lollies and see if they've got a uh, yarn I want for the penguin. And ordered it. And... Um, I said something like, thank you for applying it. I'd completely forgotten you are a lovely lot. And he just came back, oh, thanks. I thought, <laughs> oh, bless him. Um, so, yeah, uh, that's Lolly's Wool Shack. I'll link him below. Uh, I don't think the 20% is still on unless they've got Black Friday. Uh, they're doing anything for Black Friday, I don't know. Uh, I'm trying to avoid all the Black Friday emails. I'm like, ooh, <laughs> stop it, stop it. Um, yeah, I keep waffling. So I'm going to go and drink my tea and I should probably, I wonder if I, I bet I can upload, I get all the videos uploaded on the Mac and then I can access them obviously once they're on YouTube, I can post them all from my laptop. It's the way to go. So I can stay in here where it's warm and cosy and drink my tea. Terrence's doing something. I'm going to go before he comes back in. Take care and I'll talk to you all tomorrow. Bye guys.